Arden Shift Focus viewers and hope you've been well. Now this week's show is a rocker right from the word get-go. So put away everything else and stay tuned for what's in store. Just the season to be jolly with gift shopping in all glory. Food lovers get ready for Chennai's first food magazine to hit the stalls. Money is here with a bang something totally unexpected. Find out on Shift Focus. Christmas season is here and it's inviting all the women in Chennai to shop till they drop. Now here's your feast for your eyes at the Taj Koramandal where a two-day shopping extravaganza kicked off with the Vimanisha Mega Style Souk. On an average, it takes five trips to a mall to complete all holiday shopping. With the mini malls set up like this one, all shopping can be done in 48 hours. Manisha's Manisha was back again with her hand-picked end-of-year collection, designer stalls in tow. From well-known names to startups, each stall was a surprise in one form or another. Probably Chennai's biggest shopping festival and it's happening right here thanks to Manisha from Manisha. Manisha, this time you've come back bigger and better and so many different varieties. How was it putting together this edition of the private collection? Well, I must say this time it was very nerve-wracking because we have put together about uh, 80 designers which means 80 booths to put up in a span of three to four hours. So we had our challenges but uh, it's lovely to see that everything's up now and we have a absolutely fantastic eclectic collection of jewelry and um, you know fashion wear and a lot of new products this time and not only representation from different parts of India but international players this time we have people from Germany people from Bangkok people from Italy so it's nice to see that we are able to put Chennai on the fashion map nowadays Shop until you drop, that was a mantra on every woman's mind. Of course, all that shopping does play havoc on the feet. And thanks to Manisha's fast thinking, a pit stop was set up by Oriza Spa. If you're family shopping and looking for kids wear, then that too was on display. Clothes specially and the footwears. Selection of designer sets, jewelry, and footwear. This edition also had local and international companies exhibiting their products. Riding this way was Rashmi P. Krishnan, a first timer on the circuit, who smelled as sweet as a sweet smelling stall. The 
best thing that it does right now is that people know that there's something like this in the market in Chennai. And the fact that there's a store now makes them more comfortable because they can come there leisurely and you know ask their questions, select their products. And also, since I do customized soaps, you know they can give me what they want to put in their soap. Flowers, leaves, whatever. interesting Christmas fact I read. Now the busiest shopping day in the entire year is the day before Christmas, yet we still aren't that close. Now getting ahead on the show, when the sweet scent of Malipu and the tantalizing aromas of Kothamili blend, the result is a delicious spread of food all inside one magazine called Mali. Now stemming from an online portal Mali.in, but now onto magazine shelves, Mali is Chennai's latest ingredient to enhance the food lover's appetite. I've got the full meal right here, so get set. <laughs> at the Savera Hotel had all the ingredients for an amazing launch. A great product, a bright mind behind it, the who's who of Chennai society and food and wine connoisseurs who gather to witness the launch of Chennai's first food magazine, Mali. Kavita Chusetti, the brain behind this steaming pot of recipes, facts, trends and food tricks, sported a proud smile, yet felt jittery when facing the camera. But nonetheless, her shy demeanour was soon replaced by the confidence of an entrepreneur. Kavita told me about Mali, her baby, growing up. It has um, a completely different outlook to the website. In fact, none of the features are from the site. We wanted to address a different audience, an audience in Chennai who likes to flip through pages and that's why the transition from the internet to the magazine, to the print. to a man's heart is through his stomach and Mali definitely held out immense appeal to politician, chief guest and foodie Karthi Chidambaram. I think the options for food is varied right now, very eclectic. I think people want to have a good food experience. So I think a magazine which sort of aggregates this kind of information and disseminates it to the population of Chennai will do very well. Okay, so what we're holding here is the new magazine, Mali. And it's out in the city and Nina Reddy, you inaugurated this, the first thing, and it's in your hotel itself, so I think that's a really good start. But what do you have to say about Mali itself? Okay, first of all, I'm really excited this is happening in Chennai, and I'm receiving the first copy. It's a privilege. Um, what I can say is, I think we require this in Chennai, and uh, we're going to make sure that, you know, all of us figure in in this, yeah? The magazine is sure to whet your visual appetite too, from the designing to the features to recipes for kids and even a food calendar in the centre of the magazine. Each segment is an element, making Mali a complete family read. Time to lay back and sip on your glass of wine or water while Shift Focus takes a break. But don't sip too much, come back cause there's more happening on the other side. Indian contemporary music is turned up to full volume as Yotaka launched their debut album. <laughs> 